Hello and welcome to the Culinary Exchange. My name is Matthew and in this video we're making pimento cheese. I have a large bowl and to it I'm going to add three quarters of a cup of mayonnaise. Use your favorite. Three quarters of a cup of Greek yogurt. Half teaspoon of garlic powder. Teaspoon of ancho chili powder and just a dash of hot sauce. Give this a mix. To this I'm going to add four ounces of diced jarred pimento peppers. You can add more or less to taste. To this I'm going to add a pound of my favorite cheddar. This is a farmhouse cheddar. I grated it on my box grater. Just use the small side. Check for seasoning. Dash of salt, not too much because the cheddar is salty. Nice crack of black pepper. Dash more hot sauce. Stir it together. I'll put my pimento cheese in a bin and I'll refrigerate it for about an hour just to let the flavors come together. I have some of our pimento cheese that's been cooling in the fridge. You can let it come to room temperature if you'd like. Just going to spread it on some crackers. Give it a taste. Whoa, that cheddar cheese and those pimento peppers go so nicely together with just a dash of heat and smokiness from the ancho chili powder in the hot sauce. Delicious. What else can you do with the pimento cheese? Why? Make grilled cheese, of course. Have some butter, some nice pieces of rye bread. I'm just going to spread this side with some butter. Flip both pieces over. Spread this side. Take some of my nice pimento cheese spread. Put it right in the middle. Put the top on and we're ready to grill it. Give it a taste. Mm, oh my goodness. Oh, the cheese is melty. When those flavors come out, it's creamy. Delicious. And there you have it. Well, that's how you make pimento cheese. Hey, for more great recipes and cooking tips, come visit us at theculinaryexchange.com. I'm Matthew. Thanks for watching.